Hi, this is Yijin Cheng. I'm just testing the Unity 3D Pro for iOS development. I'm building a virtual world, including characters, props, buildings, trees, and so on and so forth, just to test the capability of what the iOS can do in terms of graphics and the coding. There are a few characters in here built in Blender 3D, textured in Photoshop, including the the engine room, the puppet monster, the country hut, and the teeth monster. Now these are individual scripts describing their movement um, and how they follow you. Um, collision detection isn't implemented first. I just want to test to see if the characters follow you. Um, just sort of a merging JavaScript you know, in different files and also the C sharp programming script. Um, these models are animated in Blender. Um, very different animation sequences. And if you move, it's going to move with you. If you stop, it's going to move to a certain extent before it stops. So, and then it transitions to an idle mode playing the animation um, in idle. So the shadows on the ground for the characters, since they're moving, I'm using the uh, projector, shadow projector, because um, Unity iOS doesn't support, or for any mobile, doesn't support real-time shadows. For the props, you know, the um, buildings and the trees, I've um, generated a light map for the ground so that it looks much better. Okay, excellent. Well, the next step is to try out the augmented reality for the iOS.